John the Butler. I am play, uh, gonna do my deck pro profile for my Arboros deck. Um, this will be on card capital to Super Gunji. Um, this deck really did really well at regional. Yes, admire the mat. This is my my avatar. Um, this deck did really well. I was very shocked uh, at the overall amount that people didn't know what they did. Um, I mean, it's, I, I know it's not exactly top tier, but it's, it's a lot of fun, and it's definitely a contender. Um, so I'm going to go ahead. I already did a deck profile a few weeks ago of this deck, but I've changed it, and I'll show you what I've done. So we begin with our starting Vanguard. Uh, any classic ride chain, you play the grade one over it, it gets to search for the grade two or the three. Um, this card kind of sucks if you can't ride that, just because you pull it back, and, but it does make for a nice 4K booster. Uh, so the rest of my triggers, I ran four. Uh, the Chestnut Bullet for Sweet Honey. Four of the uh, Masquerade, or not the Masquerade, the Musketeer. And then four of the Four Leaf Fairy. Um, so pretty basic. It was plenty enough pressure. The draw power was there, which was nice. Um, so we go into grade ones. Four of the branch of the ride chain, which is nice about that when the grade two rides branch, you can clone something that's on the field. So ideally, you would really like your, your setup to be this. I heard cloning was illegal. <laughs> cloning is illegal, but not to a bunch of plant ancient dragons. dragons. Yes, plant dragons. So I also run four of him. I run him? three popcorn, caramel oh. popcorn, no, and no, 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 no. I only run three made in the Blossom Rain. Um, uh, I felt like three was fine. I, I kept drawing enough where I didn't need the fourth, and I'll show you exactly what happened when I was drawing. So, grade twos. Uh, we run four of the timber. Again, when the grade two rides over that, it gets to full card. When the grade three rides it, you get to clone another card. So again, your ideal is to get that back row, three Corlas, three Popcorn, so you have at least 10 or 11K boosters when Arboros' spec kicks off. And then these are the MVP of the deck. Um, I'm gonna play both of these. Glass Beads and uh, Maiden of the Rainbow Wood. They applied so much pressure to your my opponents that they had no choice other than letting me basically either kill their rear guards, counter blast two, and draw a card. So essentially, in a turn, I was walking out either to four to five cards in hand every time, just depending on if I hit a draw trigger or not. And the best part is my opponents were more afraid of these and killing these than they were my actual vanguard. So they were mis uh, mis attacking in my minds, and they would take them out and I would just replay them. So I feel those are the MVPs of the, the deck. Um, grade threes, uh, of course, this is my avatar, Arbalos Dragon Sephirot. Uh, absolutely loved this card when playing it because when the grade two's in the soul, you get a thousand boosts. And if you don't, he does get a little bit weaker in my mind because that was one of my biggest hurdles was to get over uh, in my uh, Spec Duke match, uh, which was round three. Um, the kid. I got grade locked. I had to ride glass beads uh, at two. Then I played him, and he was just so weak I couldn't get past it. Where the Spec Duke was at 11 and was having the power. Um, but overall, very good card. Uh, he he just performed wonders. And last but not least, four Maiden of the Trailing Rose. Um, the reason I run four is because again they can make a perfect column of 25. And again, my point was more focused on getting rid of this than anything. But if I had to miss ride, if I couldn't play Arboros, Maiden of the Trailing Rose was a nice touch because I, her effect is pretty cheap. Counterblast one, discard a copy of her, and set up a perfect column. And sometimes I would set up the column that I had a copy of. I might have gotten Arboros in the drive check, played Arboros next turn, and I had two perfect columns with the same thing. So now the big question. Yes. How many SPs are you missing from your place? <laughs> Just one right now, so it's at home. But I, I made in other trailing roses SP, Arboros is SP, and as soon as I get home, so will my mating of the Rainbow Wood. Um, overall, I went up against Stoat, beat it, lost to another Neo Nectar deck, lost to Spec Duke, lost to Royal Paladins, beat Aqua Force, Aqua Force. Um, Neo Nectars and got your vengeance uh, on the, on the yeah. And the Royal Paladin was the last one, so I don't care if he was great locked, still beat him. So that is the Arboros deck profile.